Here we are at Riverstone Crescent Community, a uh, very private home site setting up on the north end of the lake, or middle of the north end of the lake. Let's go take a look at what we've got in here. Here are lot 54 Riverstone, arguably could be the best lot in this community. Got 1.47 acres, about 300 feet of frontage. You've already got a dock in place. As you can see behind me, we've already got a road cut into the, to the lot here. You've got privacy. It's kind of a point lot within a, a cove area. You've got a long view. You've got great trees. Lot's been cleaned up. The lot's marked very well. As you can see from this post, and then as you scroll down the road over here to the right you'll see the other posts with the orange tape so you've got plenty of road frontage here but uh, let's head on down and show you the great build site on this property this great view the dock that's already in place because this is just a wonderful piece of property um, like I said I think it's one of the best in here here we are down at the build site you can see we came down the road as we go here to the left you'll see a vehicle down on the property so uh, you don't even need four-wheel drive you can drive right down in the property if you want to have a picnic table something like that down here which in fact there's already a picnic table and a grill on the property and then you can see the dock that's in place but great build site you could certainly have a basement home you could do a ranch style home and probably the biggest thing is look at the view that you see looking all the way down the cove it's almost like being in a cul-de-sac the other thing I like about this property, you're facing more of a uh, southeastern view. So late in the afternoon, you're going to have shade on the back deck, uh, good tree coverage, but again, just a great level area here to work with. So let's head on down to the boat dock and show you the depth of the water at the dock. All right, here we go at the dock. Um, first of all, you know, this is the Epe, or some people call it the Ironwood dock, which I think is probably one of the best products ever made as far as docks go. Um, you could come in here, pressure wash it, and really put a nice brown stain on it if you want it to look, you know, kind of a, a vibrant brown color, whatever color you may want to have. Um, as you can see, the lake is down. The uh, lake's down about five feet, so this is a great time to show that even when the lake's down about as far as it's going to go, that this dock still has plenty of water and depth to get the boat in and out. Um, another nice thing about this is we already have, he's got water in place, and he's got power. So um, again, you got a picnic table, you can come down here, hook up something power-wise, you've got water you can use, hose, need to wash the boat, something like that. Uh, if you wanted to put a uh, lift here in the dock, that wouldn't be a problem at all. So again, a property that I just can't find uh, any negatives because this is just a great piece. And again, plenty of privacy, a lot of frontage kids you know have a little sandy area off the point there to play on and uh, easy swimming area just a great place to just chill and, and enjoy if you've got any interest in this property give us a call at 800-682-9098from the top of this hill but it's located uh, in the middle of the community but a nice added attraction for Riverstone.